much of the stock market was focused on the cost of training DeepSeek's R1 AI model. It was about $6 million is what the company says. Now, my colleague Chloe and I have been reporting this morning about the cost of running DeepSeek's R1 AI model. We've spoken to a number of companies. Roadzen, a US-listed US technology group, has spoken to us. Um, they are trying to disrupt the auto insurance sector. They've shared some insurance as well as um, AI data with us. What it basically shows is that the company processed about 600,000 insurance claims in the third quarter of last year. Now, according to our calculations, if they were using OpenAI's latest O1 AI model, that would cost them about $36,000 to process all of these insurance claims. Now, if they sw switch to DeepSeek's R1 AI model, that would be about $17,000. That's a 50% drop in running costs for RoadZen if they simply swap one AI model with another. Mm. Wow, that's a tremendous savings, and I'm sure that example is, uh, you can see examples like that across industries. Is it just about cost when it comes to switching to DeepSeek's R1 from some of the incumbents, or are there other advantages? Well, companies like these have stringent requirements when it comes to you know, processing insurance claims. They are, after all, handling personal data, right? Uh, another firm we spoke to was Uda AI. Um, they're a Swedish-listed group, and they have Germany's, one of Germany's largest health insurance groups as a client. Now, their CEO was very positive about DeepSeek's R1 model because it's released as an open source, free to use commercially type of model. And that means basically the company is able to run these AI models in-house on their IT infrastructure without having to send sensitive data to open AI or any one of the big tech players. Now, Uda has also said that yes, in the near term, it'll help their profit margins. But over the long term, all of these companies plan on cutting their costs to their clients to gain market share, but they also intend on um, implementing AI in sectors that were previously uneconomical before.